Hey guys, so since I did my uh, what's in my travel makeup bag video, video, <laughs> I decided to also do a what's in my carry on because I like to watch those videos. I don't know, it for some reason gets me excited, especially if I'm traveling. I like to see what other people are bringing. And so I thought I'll do my own, which I've actually already done one like a year ago when I was going to Italy, but I thought I'll do an updated one for Mexico. Mexico, whatever. So I got my big bag right here and it's really huge as you can see. It's probably bigger than my Neverfall and um, and let's just go through it. And the first thing I actually have is this pillow that when I was going to Italy, is the light like in and out? It looks like it's in and out, but whatever. When I was going to Italy, I was going to bring like an actual pillow that I sleep on with me and I forgot to bring that. And so I had to buy this for like $40 at the airport and I kept it of course, cause if I spend $40, I'm gonna keep it. And I'm gonna take it with me because even though the flight isn't long, it's like three hours, I think, but um, I'm gonna be going straight after working the whole night. Like I'm working from 11 at night till seven in the morning. And then at like eight in the morning, I think we're going to the airport. So I'm not gonna get much sleep. So, well, any. So I'm just gonna sleep on the airplane, which is why I'm bringing that. If I had um, off the day before going, then I would just probably not bring anything because I wouldn't have to sleep on the airplane. So let's just go through this and this is, um, I forgot what company this is. I got this at Neiman Marcus. They sell it for like 150. I don't know. It's just like I thought it's a good travel bag. I used it when I was moving to to this house. I like put shoes in there and I moved them. So I'll just pull stuff out. Okay, the first thing is this little Victoria's Secret case, and I have lip products in there. And these are different different than uh, the lip products that I that I showed you in my um, what's in my makeup bag video. These are just like the chopsticks and stuff. So in here, the first thing, and this, if I forgot this, I would have to probably go to like a Mexican pharmacy. This is Zovirax. And I did a video about it like three years ago when I first attempted YouTube and then I like stopped making videos for two years. I did a video about this because it's the only thing that has ever helped me get rid of cold sores. I get cold sores, they're gross, you know, like no one wants them. Obviously you get a virus when you get it, it's stuck with you for your whole life. And this literally gets rid of them in like a day. It's amazing. It costs $30, I get, no, $20. I get it at a Polish pharmacy in my town. Um, there you don't need a prescription for it there you can just get them like in poland anywhere so they have it in the pharmacy but i think in the us if you want to get it you need a prescription for it it's called zovirex i'll put it down below you need like if you have cold sores i swear to god like you're you're gonna love it it'll go away in a day okay now that this round is over i have this little smith's minted rose minted rose lip balm because my lips are dry then I have this um, Jack Black lip balm with SPF 25 because I need that for the beach. I have this lip oil from Clarence, Clarence, and lip comfort oil. It's good, it smells like raspberries. I have the Dior lip gloss in the color Gems 169, I love it, it's very moisturizing. And my fave, um, Lipstick Queen Prince Frog green lipstick which is actually pink on your lips it's amazing i love this thing i'll put it back in because because i gotta take it with me next thing is this amazing amazing um cardigan see i'm like forgetting english uh, i'm gonna start talking in polish <laughs> But um, it's a Barefoot Dreams cardigan. I got it at the Nordstrom anniversary sale. I've wanted the cardigan and the bathrobe for literally like two years and I didn't want to pay $99. And this I think was like 97 original price. So I waited, I um, was so happy to see it in the anniversary sale and I got it and it'll actually be the first time I use it because I'm always freezing in the airplanes, like always freezing. It could be like 130 degrees outside, I'll still be freezing. So, and it feels, like a cloud it's just it feels like it's almost like moisturizing you know like those socks that you buy that are moisturized that you put at night it feels just like that it's amazing so got that for when i get cold which i will 
I have two magazines that I bought like a month ago and I never read, which is the Glamour and Cosmo. And I don't really like Cosmo. I, don't, I used to read it all the time and I don't like it anymore. So I don't know why I bought it, but what else? Got my card case with some cards in there and some cash for tips. I got three glasses. So I have my reading glasses because I'm blind as a bat. Like I'm wearing contacts right now. I am blind as hell. I could never... These are from Warby Parker. Like I could never exist without these. I Like I... One time, I'll tell you a story. One time I was driving home from work when I worked in a restaurant and my contact was really bothering me. It turns out that it ripped like in my eye. So I had to take it off and I couldn't see like the street when I was driving. My mom had to come and drop, uh, drop a pair of glasses off because I couldn't get home. That's how blind I am. Then I have my also prescription sunglasses because sometimes if you sleep at the beach, you don't want to really wear contacts because they get dry and stuff, so I got prescription ones. These are also Warby Parker, and this is the style Riley, R-E-I-L-L-Y, and these are my favorite. I love this shape, the color, everything is like the best sunglasses that I've ever had. I have to get them without prescription to, to wear them like every day. Then I have regular sunglasses. These are Tom Ford, Abby, and I'm actually, like I'm, I wanted to sell them, I listed them, but no one bought them, so I'm just gonna take them with me. What else? Right. I got my passport. Gotta have that if you're going to Mexico. I got my um, charger for my phone. This is a heavy ass brick. I used to have one from Costco that I loved that um, died. So like three years later, I bought this. And just the Apple. These damn Apple chargers are like the worst. Look at this. It happens every single time. I've gone through like 20 of them. I hate it. I have a pair of socks because again, I get cold. Oh, I didn't even know that was in there. Victoria's Secret lip gloss. Have a mirror because you gotta have a mirror, especially in an airplane. I have the Righteous Body Butter because you know, moisturizing. And I have this uh, fresh lotion for the body from Diptyque that I use as my hand lotion because it's amazing. I have, this was actually already on here. It's like a makeup removing wipe. I got it in like from like a hotel or something I was staying at. Just stayed in there. I have a pen, cause you sometimes when you come back into the country, you have to fill in like a form of what you purchased in that country. So I always need a pen. And the last thing, my perfumes, which I'm taking in my carry-on because, and not like my carry-on suitcase, just in my carry-on handbag, because I'm always paranoid that they'll break, so I want to have them like right on me, just so I can keep an eye. And for perfume, I take, I'm taking the Coco Chanel Mademoiselle, Bobby Brown Beach, and Bronze Goddess SP Lauder. I might also take the Victoria's Secret Heavenly Summer, um, but that I could just put in the suitcase. It's not going to break. It's super thick, but... Um, but yeah, that's all that I'm taking and I'm probably gonna wear like sweatpants or probably, no, better yet leggings in case it's super hot there. I know last time I went with Peter to that same resort like eight years ago, it was I think February here and I wore Uggs because it was freezing and then I get there and I'm like, oh my God, I didn't have any flip flops in my bag. I had to wear Uggs all through like me Mexico to get to the resort, it was so embarrassing. But yes, I'm probably gonna wear leggings tank top um, and then like flip-flops you know something easy or maybe toms I love toms and so that's it uh, I hope you enjoyed it if you are traveling anywhere let me know I love to hear about travels I love travel vlogs I have a um, Italy vlog if you're interested from last summer you can check out a link down below and thank you for watching bye